Welcome to my channel once again. Thank you for tuning in, my fastinistas. I'm bringing you this video to share with you one of my another famous um, handkerchief skirts. And this time I decided to also incorporate, applique to a t-shirt. And right here in this video, I am um, fitting the skirt to the dress form. Um, it doesn't have a zipper in there yet, but, um, and it also, this skirt, I decided to place pockets on each side, as you see there, and um, just fitting it a little bit more to the dress form so it can look, you know, presentable. Smoothing it out a little bit. Yeah. yeah, I'm trying to get a better look at the whole thing. I'm getting ready to work on the applique that is um, on the t-shirt. It is, uh, I did it on a, a cutout of a African um, t-shirt that I had and I cut out it to be my pattern for, as an applique for this particular um, shirt but yeah and I'm getting ready to um, sew the applique on right here as you can see I have my pins in place to hold it in place I'm getting ready to just you know do a little bit of a um, Make sure it's straight. Adjustments to it. Make an adjustment. I think that's about right, right there. Yep. And get ready to start sewing it. I'm using a curved needle and thread. And I am doing a basic stitch. And it took me maybe about a good 10 to 15 minutes to um, complete the sew on applique. It's pretty simple. I'm just trying not to sew in my actual dress form in the back because sometimes you can, you know, end up stitching that onto your uh, your design. And that's why I'm lifting it up with just a tad bit. Right here, I'm finishing up on the applique and I'm getting ready to start on the sleeve. I wanted to give it a little bit more, the t-shirt a little bit more style. And right here, you see me pinning on um, some fabric onto the sleeve. And what I did, I cut it in three, three inch width and measured it the length. And I, you could tell right there where I surged it and I folded both sides over and then folded the whole thing in half. And that's how I'm placing it on the sleeve right there. And yes, I did the other side already. And here comes the final result of what I did. Um, this is the mask. I did a face mask and some matching earrings I made. And this is the finished look. I think it came out pretty good. 
Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I thank you for tuning in to Max Closet channel. Have a blessed one. Peace.